focus. Lord, we do not know where you are going. How can we know the way? In today's gospel, Thomas poses an obvious question to Jesus. Truly, if a group of people do not know their destination, how can they know the way? The early Christians, called followers of the way, knew the answer. The way they followed was a way of life. A way of life that we by large have forgotten. There was a truth that gave them abundant life and it enabled them to hold all things in common. Lives immersed in prayer and the sure knowledge of the love of God helps them willingly accept persecution and rejection. We as individuals, as a church and as a people have drifted far from this way. We have lost our way in our clinging to power, prestige and possessions. We have abandoned the truth and are engaged in the wanton destruction of the earth and its resources. We have forgotten how to live with untroubled hearts. We have failed to believe. We do not remember that there are many rooms in the Father's house and that all who live the way of Jesus are welcome there, irrespective of caste or creed. So let us ask Jesus the same question today. How can we know the way? And then listen for his answer. Fruit Lord, may we learn to walk in your way, rejoice in your truth and seek the fullness of the life you offer.